And in the beginning, when God created man in Genesis chapter 2, he beheld man's loneliness and said that it was not good. So he created the woman from a bone, a rib, from his side, if you will notice, it's from his side. So you can be next to her, not a bone from the head so you can hover over her and dominate her, not a bone from your foot so you, she can be placed under you. No, there's a bone from the side so you two can be next to one another. He brought that woman. So who gives the lovely Princess Jasmine to be buried to Kevin? We do. Amen. All right. Kev, go get her. <laughs> in me in this great state of Virginia and the church of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, I pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your wife. Amen. I am pleased to present to you for the very first time Mr. and Mrs. Kevin and Jasmine Wiggins. Thank you to Mr. and Mrs. Smith. Thank you for allowing me to marry Jasmine. Um, <laughs> a beautiful bride. <laughs> um, you've raised an amazing woman, um, and I wouldn't have any other girl as my wife. Um, and I'm glad that she is the person that she is because of you too. and the harmony that Jazz had, um, you know, as she greeted everyone when we first met her. And I knew that this was something special for Kev. because so I saw the way he introduced her, and I saw um, how he looked at her and looked at everyone else. It was, it was meant to be, as, as you know, we would say so. And I just knew right off the bat that Kev was indeed the right one for her. Their, uh, <laughs> their connection was so, um, organic and fluid and illuminating. Ooh. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you.